Welcome back to Kung Fu Maintenance. Today we'll be showing you how to change out three-way switches. That switch right there and this switch right here both control the light here as well as another light that goes up here but that one's getting changed out. So it's this one here and we'll verify that everything is working properly. Today I'm going to be showing you how it, an easy way to change these out when everything's working properly. This one is uh, both switches operate both sides. Three-way switches have a set of travelers that travel over and basically communicate how the light is set up. Uh, the tricky part is figuring out which wire goes on the black wire here, on the black screw. Um, but if your system's already working exactly right, I'm going to show you how easy it is to change them out. What I'm going to do is turn everything off. It's just going to make everything much safer to work on. That way everything's off and we're good to go. It's also a good idea to follow up with a circuit alert device and double check. Um, but anyway, mine's all off. I can just prove it by turning the power back on. Um, I've already pre-taken the screws out, getting this one ready. And what we can do here is find the one that's on the black screw, put that one on the black screw of our new one, and then everything will work properly. So I'm going to do that now. Um, this particular one is quick wired. Uh, I'm going to be not quick wiring this one, and this is uh, kind of what I was wanting to show you on this particular these rocker switches. This particular brand. It's not so easy to tell for the quick wire which one actually goes to the black wire. Is it this screw port or is it this hole or is it this hole? It's really not very clear which one is going to the black wire. To the common. So instead of doing it that way, we're just going to be mimicking the wire that goes to the black wire. So here we go. And get it down. Okay. Just gotta release my deals here. So there's the one going to our black screw. Okay, now here's our new one. And so we'll wrap the wires with the direction of the screw. This one will go this way. this way and this one will go up. Okay, so our, our one that was on the black screw goes on the black screw here. And this one here. All 
Wrapping it with the direction the wire turns makes it more likely for the screw to be grabbed and turned in with the screw rather than it being pushed out. It's a little bit better. Okay. We're all in there and now that's ready to install. I'm just going to fold the wires, set it in place, and I can pre-start it just a tiny bit. I'll come back with my drill and I'm going to be changing all the rocker switches so I can just do them kind of assembly line style, but let's get it started now for testing purposes. We can verify that everything does what it's supposed to be. Okay, so now we'll go turn our breaker on. There it is, and it's on. Now this one can be turned off. We can go back to that one and turn it on. There we go. We can leave it on, turn it off from the other one. So we've got our full three-way control. So now I'll go ahead and turn it all back off. And we'll change the other breaker or the other switch. The same thing, but since we're we're just mimicking exactly what we have. Just makes it a lot easier. The black screw going to the black screw. And again, these are these new rockers, they're just kind of silly on how it's designated. You can't really tell which screw is actually being designated to the black wire. My guess is it's this one, but you know, it's kind of funky. Um, these are labeled top and bottom, but on the three-way, we can just mimic what we have. So, and I'm also just mimicking the right and the left side in that normally the hot is on the right side and the neutral is on the left side, but on a switch, you don't have hot and neutral. They're all hot, so there is no neutral. Just hot and switched hot, so, or switched hots, plural. Grab my tool. I don't know why I closed it up. Anyway, now we'll release the quick release. There we go. And the one on the right. One on the left. There we go. And again, these two will get wrapped this way. And the other one will get wrapped up. Okay, here's our black wire. Just like last time. You can see how it draws the screw around when you wrap it the correct way. Pulls it around. See, nice and easy. Okay, 
Now insert our switch and we're ready for the install. And again, I'm just going to kind of pre-start it. And I'll come back with my drill and finish the job. Since I have a bunch more to do anyway. Okay, now we're ready for the test. Turn it on. And now we can test it. Turned it off. Okay. This one turned it back on. This one turned it all back off and we're good to go. Thanks for watching Kung Fu Maintenance, over and out. That's the easy way to change out the three-way light switches and not have any questions or any issues, not any problems. Um, I show other videos showing how to show tell which one is the black wire, uh, but this was a, just a nice easy way to do it if everything was already working properly. Thanks for watching Kung Fu Maintenance, over and out. Okay, so now I got my drill for a nice speedy install.